Ladies and gentlemen, we're always excited when our next guest uh, drops by for a visit. This guy's very, very funny. I don't like going to the doctor much. I, I join an HMO because they don't like me going to the doctor much either. <laughs> We've been married a while, no kids. Friends ask why. Well, we never have enough money to have kids. They say, well, you never have enough money to have kids. <laughs> yeah, that's what I just said. <laughs> and ladies and gentlemen, please welcome back to the program Jeff Caldwell. Jeff Caldwell. Jeff Caldwell. Jeff Caldwell. He is tonight making his 1,000th appearance on the show. Security is a concern. Apparently, cyber terrorists are targeting our banking system. Ooh, boy, that'd be horrible if they wiped out my credit history. That's, uh, that's my only shot at owning a home right there. <laughs> I'm trying to get tech savvy. Now I have the uh, hands-free device for the cell phone, and that's a wonderful design. It's got the speaker, fits right in my ear hole, and the microphone extends about to the tip of my ear lobe. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. We're having trouble hearing you, Jeff. Well, that's because the sound comes out of this hole in the front of my face right here. <laughs> yeah, the vibrations through my jawbone, a little indistinct sometimes. <laughs> my apologies. I was reading the back of a beer bottle, brewed in strict accordance with the Bavarian purity law of 1516. <laughs> yes. Medieval hygiene standards. <laughs> oh, they were so wise in 1560. Many of them lived to be 30. <laughs> yes, the, the master brewers would skim the dead birds out of the vat and sell the beer to those who hadn't been rendered blind or insane by the last batch. We have to trust the people that handle our food. I'm always nervous of those little home cooking restaurants. You'll see them on the highway. Ed's Country Kettle. Mmm. Country with a K. Oh. Ed, you've misspelled country. A, makes me think uh, you might forget to wash your hands periodically. <laughs> Makes me think I might get a little E. coli with a K. <laughs> Maybe some country cramps. <laughs> then we pass our crazy eating habits onto our young people. Now we have yogurt in a tube for kids on the go. Oh. Ah. Kids are too busy to learn how to eat like human beings, right? <laughs> I'm 17 and I can't use a spoon. I eat from tubes and drink from sippy cups. I'm on the go. Well, we'll hold on to your resume and let you know if anything comes up. <laughs> my nephews know more than anybody else I know about electronics. They uh, help me upgrade my smartphone. Oh, it's nice. Touch screen. Exclamation point is right next to the question mark, so often I think I've sent an innocent inquiry. I've sent an outrageous demand. <laughs> I thought I texted my wife, you go to the grocery? I texted, you go to the grocery! These scientists are fantastic. The medicines we have now. My wife's birth control pills also prevent acne. Yeah. Coincidentally, when I was a teenager, acne was my form of birth control. I'm fighting back with technology. I synced my calorie counter app with my pedometer app, and it looks like I'm getting 40 miles per gallon of gin. We got wireless in the quarterback's helmets, instant replay cameras in HD, in 3D. Still measuring first downs with two sticks and a chain. <laughs> oh, it's gonna be close. They'll need to measure. Here comes Lewis and Clark's survey crew. <laughs> I like the people in the ad for the herpes medicine. They always seem to be kayaking. <laughs> mm. Yeah. Uh, 
I'm not an epidemiologist, but maybe we ought to take a look at these rental kayaks. I think I found the problem. Let's spray them out like we do bowling shoes, people. Oh, but they're so active. I'm not letting herpes keep me down. My wife and I need to stay away from the sales. We charge too much, and the credit cards give you incentives to use the cards even more irresponsibly, right? Frequent flyer miles, that's convenient. Yeah, your debt gets high enough, you can flee the country. <laughs> Honey, we're finally gonna take that Mexican vacation we've been talking about. <laughs> and we leave tonight. Vamanos! I tried to call information. It's not a person anymore. It's a computer trying to decipher what I say, and that technology, not finished. <laughs> I'd lost my credit card. What listing? American Express. The toll-free number for America West Airlines is... <laughs> what if you need something important in a hurry? Suicide hotline. The number for Susan Huntley is... <laughs> Susan, you don't know me. 